I've been interested in capos for a while, and you know, I started out just like anyone using one capo um, to cover all the all the strings on the guitar, and uh, I started um, shifting the capo so that it wouldn't it wouldn't cover all the strings, uh, so that you can get you know this low bass note to kind of resonate through. But then I found it's uh, a little easier just to uh, take a file and maybe cut a groove in the capo itself so you don't have to just shift it. You can actually put it over the top like this. Um, and then, uh, you know, you can do all kinds of things. So once you have a capo on like that, you can play behind it, right? Because there's a hole in it. So I'm going to show you an example of a little song I wrote. Put one here. This little silver one um, is a really... It's a short one, it only covers four strings. I cut the end off with a saw. I'm just gonna stick it right here for easy access. You know? So this is just an example. This is a song I wrote, it's called Love Song. It's on my my latest album, Missile Bell. And uh, it's just one of the fun things you can do with capos, so it goes like this. <laughs> So, capo stuff is a lot of fun.